Okay, what we're doing, we're gonna pull the tractor ahead, that's what he's doing right now. And then we're gonna unhook the cable on the backstop way down there, wind up the cords, and back it up right beside this one, put it on the other bag, and start all over again. Now on this bag, usually there's a piece of red tape that knows, lets you know when you're towards the end. Uh, evidently in the factory for this bag, they forgot to put the piece of red tape on. Now that's the second time that's happened to us, but whatever. Looks like we're going to have to get some silage out of there so we can close it up because I always just go until the red tape and the red tape never showed up. Set up the next bag and it just starts freaking raining again. They say we're supposed to have good weather. I know, it's freaking 30% and it rains. It's bullshit. Whatever. Ground right up. Don't mow the cows. It's getting dark. We need to get shit done. Grab another gear. Frick, wrong one. What the heck? Whatever. Ah, shit, I forgot it's muddy. Can't go as fast. Whatever. Get back to work. Looks like the chopper's over there somewhere. Fall oh, straight to that seat. Gotta get to work.
after a half an hour freaking uh, putting in a new roll pin on the top beater, we're going again. We got this one, two other full ones. He's done chopping since he ran out of the wagons while I was fixing it and he came in and helped me fix it. Now we're I think we're just gonna finish unloading this one and I'll unload the other two in the morning before we start chopping. Right side's 4440, left side's 4450. Evidently I don't have my light on, so I'm walking through a mud hole. That I didn't know that was there. It's like uh, 9.30 I think, 9.45 out. Beautiful earlier over here. But, I think that's the last video for tonight. Catch ya tomorrow, hopefully our last day we finish it. If we don't get rain. Going up this pretty steep hill here. We have steeper. It's just pretty long.
talking because I thought I had, I think, pretty sure I have enough of us actually doing stuff. So, got this bag full. See, there's that red tape. That lets you know when, I don't know how many feet it is from the bag. So what we usually do if we have enough hay, when we see that mark, we put one more load in. And lucky enough, we stopped that load here. And not this wagon, but the other one went right here. And I brought this one here just to make sure it was empty all the way. There was a little bit left. This is all the spillage. That mud hole was a pain. It's dried up a lot since then, but what we need to do is smit this, or that'd be the best thing. Put add the cement from there all the way to the property line. Yes, that's the property line. There's a fence on the street. And that's the neighbors. Because we we make five bags. Pretty much we do five hay bags, but this year we're chopping oats, so we're doing four hay bags and one oat bag. And then once we get rid of this backstop, that hump will fall down like that. There's a box when you throw away. All this stuff usually settles. And that's just from the cable, usually that gets washed off by rain eventually. These bags are pretty thick, so. And on this one, I guess the tractor started going like that a little bit. So I had to do the same thing for this one, otherwise that cable thing would've hit that big lump that came out the side. And on this bag, we went too far, so now we have to carefully take out some until about right here so we can close it up because in the factory they forgot to put the piece of red tape on because it should be, you know, like somewhere in here, the red tape, but there's none which second time this has happened but what do you do if I would have knew what the red tape was I would have stopped but I didn't think of anything of it because I didn't see no red tape yet but I should have stopped like right there so we have enough to close it out but such is life so this is the last clip for chopping. I'm not gonna show taking that off because I think you've seen it. I can't remember anymore. But hopefully these were a couple good videos. I don't know how many I'll make it into. Probably two or three. Two for sure. But any questions, let us know. Now we're gonna switch from chopping mode to baling mode. We cut a bunch of hay. Yesterday and today for round bailing Tate was and I'm cutting tomorrow We got another farm to do Two farms one farm has one hay field the other one has a bunch of little fields which adds up to like 20 acres Anyway I don't do this much please comment. Yeah, you don't have to comment rate and subscribe and I wonder if these guys have a website where you can complain that they forget to put the red tape on, but can't do much about it. And we didn't get rained out today. That's a nice thing, even though it was 30%.